Here we are at our adoption fair. It's an Adopt an Angel adoption fair. Today, it's uh, Saturday, November 20th, and we're going to show you some of our homeless animals today. Um, it's been a pretty busy day with lots of people and lots of lookers. So far, one cat, adult cat, and one um, small dog got adopted. So I want to introduce you to the rest of the ones that are homeless. Let me see Jock. Jacques! Hey Jacques! This is Jacques coming back from a walk with one of our fabulous volunteers. Okay. Um, and here is Bernie. Hi Bernie! Bernie! Hello! Bernie is a um, yellow lab hound mix. He's about couple years old and he's got a bad limp. He was hit by a car. It's an old injury. And he walks kind of funny, but the vet says it's no big deal. Just a gimpy walk. This is Lucky. Lucky! Lucky is an Australian Shepherd. Um, looks pretty close to being a purebred. Nice dog. He is about two and a half years old. Moving on, we got a dog that's out on a walk. There's Jock getting his drink. Oh, here's famous Buckwheat. Hi, Buckwheat. Hi, buddy. Hello. He is about uh, same one year, so only about 30 pounds. Little guy. Can't really tell. He's yelling at you to adopt him. Here is sweet Holly. Hi, Holly! Holly is about 10 years old. She is spayed with all her shots. Couch potato, lazy dog. Would love a nice family who would, um, elderly family or quiet home. Here is Dolly. Dolly is another senior of ours, and she's been homeless for, looks like, three months now. I'm going to turn around and look at all the people and a car going by. So, here's Dolly. It can be quite frightening at these adoption fairs. Holly's yelling at the cars to please stop. She's got a, um, she's a little hard of hearing, so it must have been really loud for her. Moving on. Oh, there's Spike. Hi, Spike. Spike is a nice dog. He's a mid-sized dog. Maybe he has some Aussie in him. He's exhibiting some herding tech, um, characteristics. He's neutered with all shots and heartworm negative. And he's been homeless since September. This is Sheba. Hi, Sheba. Sheba was adopted. She just got returned yesterday. She is, um, wasn't very good with the small children because she's playful, rambunctious, and they said too much dog for the family. So she probably should go to a home with maybe older kids, 10 years or better. She's about 40 pounds, good mid-sized dog. Sweet, spayed with all shots, only about six months old. Here is Ellie. Hi, Ellie! Ellie has been homeless, oh, since uh, October. She was a puppy that got adopted, and then she has been returned because she's um, uh, very playful, too playful for the other dogs, stuff like that. She's about eight months or so. She looks like she could be Greyhound and um, Shepherd mix. But sweet and gentle, no matter what anyone says. Got a scan down here and look at, people are looking at our dogs. Hopefully someone will adopt. Look at There's a I'm nice, a Petco volunteer, <laughs> Petco worker, I should say. I thought I'd do a tape of our adoption fair so people could see what's actually going on. Now moving over to the kitties. This is, oh, this is, looks like, that's Hazel. She's six month old Tabby. Hi, Hazel. Here is Princess. Princess is five years old, black and white, female, spade, declawed, and has no interest in people or anyone at this point. Mad as H E double hockey sticks, as my son says. 
at being at this horrible adoption fair and being homeless. Just brought in today from the owner is having knee surgery. He's 82 and doesn't anticipate coming back home. So poor princess, she is missing him. Moving on over here. Oh, this is Sunshine. Sunshine has been homeless since September. Sunshine! Hi, Sunshine! And that's Pretty Tulip. I'm going to open this up so you can see them in action. <gasps> Tulip! Hello, pretty girl. Oh, she's such a good girl. We love her. And there it is. Sunshine says, wait a minute, pet me. Very hard sometimes for the kitties to get adopted at these events because it is loud and cats like it quiet. But we don't have a real shelter. It's the best we can do. This is Katie. Katie just came out of New Hanover Animal Control a couple days ago. Katie! Hello, Katie! Show us your pretty face. <gasps> there she is. Oh, hello. She spayed with all her shots two. Moving on. This is Jasper. Jasper. Oh, Jasper. Jasper is um, the tabby in white I'm looking at right now. And that is Tippy. Both came out of New Hanover Animal Control yesterday. They had run out of time. Too many animals at the shelter right now. I'm going to get down here and show you Jasper. Jasper, show us your pretty face. Come on. Come on, try to get adopted. Jesus, I just hate it here. I just hate it. Oh, look at him. Jasper was on TV a couple days ago. I think Steven from Animal Control took him on TV. Sherry, is there Sherry? All right, moving on. I'm Robin from Okay, here's some more people up there, and, okay, this one is um, a mother cat, they had some kittens, oh, probably months ago, they all found homes, but nobody has taken her yet, and her name is Lula. Hi, Lula, a pretty pastel, pastel calico, oh, and this is Ghoul. He was homeless for Halloween, if you can't tell. He's a Russian blue. Come here, baby. Hi, sweetie. Ah. Oh. Oh, he says, I love to be petted. Oh, he's a good boy. Scary at the adoption fairs. All right. He, these two, this is a sad case. This is Tulina. Excuse me, Thelma and Louise. I said Tulina. I was reading it wrong. Thelma and Louise. They are eight years old. Can you hear a car alarm going off in the background? Boy, not ideal for poor kitties to try to find a home in. But our kitties are going with the flow. Thelma and Louise, eight years old. They are homeless because their owner has gone into a nursing home. Sad. We want them to go together, and we are letting them go for just $10 a piece. If someone would be interested and have a big enough heart to take them home. Oh. Now, who's this? Link. So this is a, an, a, um, a success story, huh? Yeah, he's good. All right, moving on. Do we have enough animals, you think? Excuse me, guys. I'm just going to try to get in tape the tape this for the... Okay. Here is... Oh, this is a nice little black kitten, four months old, a female, and two little terrified kittens, absolutely scared to death. They were trapped underneath the church, and we have been um, trying to tame them. They are very sweet 
and gentle but scared to death. And here they are at the adoption fair. It's kind of giving them some good socialization. They are available for adoption. They're fixed with shots. Leukemia negative, FIV negative, only about three months old. Oh, a car alarm now. Imagine that. <laughs> quiet for once at the adoption fair. Alright, this guy, oh this is a big huge orange tabby. I believe it's Flanagan. His owners are moving and he has, is getting adopt. he got returned today. Um, sad case because um, I think they're, they're, they're getting a divorce and poor Flanagan. Poor the family, poor everything. Just bad situation all around. And he finds himself homeless at the adoption fair. This is Gilligan. Gilligan is, oh, what a sweetie. Playful, rambunctious. We got him out of New Hanover just yesterday, too. And he is spayed with all shots. Um, and very playful. Playful like a kitten. All right. Who else? Did I miss anybody? Yes, I did. We have more. Can you imagine? There's more. All right. Here comes Bruce and Dory. These are two little kitties. Two more tabbies. Adults. Begging for a home. They are also, it says, my owners rescued me in Florida, moved to Wilmington, and now separated. They don't want me anymore. My sister is Dory in the cage with me. I love to be outside. They are two sisters. This nice lady is looking at both of these. No, no, no. Oh, no, that's Bruce and Dory. I'm sorry. Where's Thelma and Louise? Oh, you're looking at Thelma and Louise? That would be awesome. I'm just I can do a deal for you. They're $10 a piece, it already says. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and we've got over here Salem. Salem. Oh, a nice solid black six month old black cat. You can't beat it. Can't beat it. Look at him. Just full and full of love. And he doesn't care that he is about six inches. Do you believe it or not? Six inches from the road. Maybe, maybe two feet. <laughs> <laughs> he is, look at him, he is easy going. Same with this guy. This is Smokey, easy going, very easy going, aren't you? Hi sweetie! Again, every animal out here is already fixed with its shots. All the dogs are heartworm negative. If not, they've been treat. if they're positive, we're treating them for heartworm. Look at, getting love from a nice volunteer. Alright, get back in. I want to make sure I got every dog because some of them were out. I don't know. Here's Sissy. Did we miss Sissy? Rat Terrier. Sissy's a, Sissy's a rat terrier. Showed up at Pender Animal Control. Ah. Uh, she was pregnant. We got her and she was spayed. We didn't know she was pregnant, but she was. Um, poor thing. Look at her. Making sure I'm getting everybody. Again, lots of people looking and interested. Here's this guy who was out on a walk. We missed this one. Just got out of Brunswick Animal Control this morning. Neuter, spayed with all shots. Um, heartworm negative. Turned in because she has a heart murmur. The people didn't want her with a heart murmur. So, we don't care. Someone will want her. Someone will love her. Right, baby girl? Okay, that should be it. I think we got everybody on the adoption fair. This is it. Today we're here every Saturday and Sunday from 11 to 5 at Petco. You can come and see all of the animals and people. It's a big event. Here we are. Okay, I'm going to kind of move out so people can see how really large it is. Huge. I bet there's what? Probably 6, 8, 12, 14, 16.
About 25 to 30 homeless animals sitting on the sidewalk at Petco today. Every Saturday and Sunday from 11 to 5, come and see us and adopt one, please. Thank you from Adopt an Angel.